And that was like the dumbest shit I ever seen white people do with weed. But I had so I fucking high. I was like, what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> And he was like, and he passed it to me. He didn't tell me shit. He didn't tell me shit. But yeah, mind you, Q passed it to me. Didn't tell me there was vodka and said, just hit it, bro. I'm like, oh, it's just a ball. Fuck it. And I hit it. And then I was like, whoa, what the fuck is this? This is not just weed. He's like, bro, there's vodka in it. <laughs> a is just sitting there. He's fucking jail. I like this. Right, he's, a, in he's, he's, in, he's in jail. Says, Bro, it hits very nicely. We should keep hitting this, bro. We should do this every you day, like bro. And I'm like, that's what he sounded like half the you time, know, bro. But, but he had like this, like, but he had like this lazy voice. So he sounded like this. He was like, bro, we should hit this all the time, bro. And he always carried a knife on his hip. No matter what he yeah, was we wearing, he's this. always carrying a knife. Even if he was in fucking sweats, he was carrying a knife. Sweats in his house, shirtless. He was carrying a knife. If he had underwear on, he still had his knife in his hand. How you, could you be that paranoid? Anywho, and hit skull vodka out of a bong. And I'm like, this does hit pretty, I'm sitting here, well, this does hit pretty nicely, uh, but I would never do this shit again because he fucked up my brain pretty hard. Like, he fucked up my brain pretty fucking hard. And then Q proceeded to drink it. He said, Whoever got the cash part has to drink it. Oh. And he proceeded to chug skull vodka out of a goddamn bog. 